Uh, let's see. Hello. Uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is November 3rd of 2018. And it's uh, about 9.30 p.m. If you wondered why there was that hesitation at the beginning, of course I do hesitate a lot anyway without an excuse, I have a couple different programs and for recording the video and the desktop and what have you. And <clears throat> one of them counts down. I think that's, Mo well, of course you can tell it you don't want it to, but I think that's Movidia. And uh, it counts down. So I was waiting for the countdown, but I'm using Manicam for this because, well, I'm not sure. I'm having a problem with, been having problems with audio. I always have problems with audio. Uh, well, sometimes it, sometimes the audio is good, but I went back to, I'm going back to the headset, and I have a bunch of cameras and audio boxes, and I just can't seem to get things set correct and right, so I've gone back to the headset, but, uh, and I just upgraded Movidia, the audio, or the video suite. And now it seems like uh, my audio is out of sync. Even when I had some good audio with different mics and things, it was out of sync. So now I'm trying again, uh, Manicam. You know, all these programs have certain things you really like about them. And it'd be nice if they could, all of them have everything, you know. Maybe they do if you pay enough money. Uh, this video is going to be about uh, a couple programs that come with the Sony Xperia XA2 Ultra. As you can see, I purchased it on October 26th of 2018, and it's November 3rd of right now, and I really like it. I have a rubberized case on this thing now, by the way. Uh, well, I think it only cost about $8. I'm using a Microsoft Launcher. I'll probably change because I'm always changing things, but right now I'm using Microsoft Launcher. Uh, the Sony cell phone comes with at least two apps that I know of that are Sony apps. Wait, is the second one a Sony app or not? I think it is. So anyway, the uh, Sony Xperia a XA2 Ultra, I like it. Uh, it comes with AR Effect. And if you look at this picture of me down here in this lower left-hand corner, that's a screen grab out of a short video that I made using the AR effect. And um, I can't find the little video right now, or I would include it. But it's a kind of a neat uh, little program. AR effect, you can get it from the, well, from the Google Play Store. Um, I think I can demonstrate, let's see. I think they have a video here. They do, okay. This will probably get me a uh, hit from YouTube that I'm using somebody else's music or material or something. And, but anyway, let's give it a try. It's from Sony, so they're trying to promote their products, but they probably... Let's see.
Okay. Gave you a little bit of an uh, idea of it. Apparently, it only works with Sony cameras or with Sony uh, cell phones. And from the comments that people have left, Apparently this does something when you uh, shake it. I don't. I didn't know it was one. It had one of those. I think it does. Anyway, maybe I hit something. Uh, apparently, you have to have a Sony cell phone, and it has to be one of the later models. And I'm just going by the comments. But anyway, when you go to uh, The app store, it'll tell you, you know, this app is compatible with some of your devices or with, you know. If I just had one device, cell phone or whatever, it would say, you know, compatible or not compatible. So, um, see, there's comments here that uh, people have had some trouble with it or something. But it looks pretty neat. I did mess with it a long time. So that's one app that, and I believe it can be uninstalled. I believe. But it came installed on the software that was installed on the cell phone. The other is Sketch. And uh, it's a drawing and painting you can you know write on the screen looks pretty neat but I noticed that there are a whole bunch of uh, and this apparently will uh, I believe works on any device and I'm not sure if they have a Apple app or not but it looks uh, you know you can draw on the right take notes do stuff like that um, so both of those come. Um, that's the cell phone. I'm using Microsoft Launcher right now, but I may switch around. I've paid for a bunch of the different launchers that you have to pay for, you know, not much money, but right now I'm using the Microsoft Launcher. I uh, I like it, but I may change because I changed too many times. Uh, so anyway, this is using Manicam, and I'm hoping and I believe that the audio sync is going to be okay. I've um, gone back to the headset. I have a bunch of microphones here, have a bunch of audio boxes, and if you've been watching the last few videos, I've tried, of course there's a bunch of things I tried that I didn't make videos of, but uh, I just don't seem like I have, that I'm smart enough to be messing with audio. I know a lot of you are, especially if you're into music or uh, podcast and that type of thing. A um, little bit of an update. I have, still have my two monitors set up. This one here on the right is a 4K, but I don't, I'm, using a 1080 so that it matches the other monitor. The uh, 4K monitor is an LG. This other one over here is an ASUS. Uh, the last video I think I made, or the video before, I think it was a video before, I was using, it's actually called LiveCam. I think it's like $49 on uh, Amazon, and it's... Uh, a copy or clone or whatever of uh, the Logitech webcam and it looks just as good 
as uh, the Logitech webcams. And this over here is a Logitech webcam. I think it's a 930, I believe. And I've got it up. Whoops, let's see if we can just switch to it. Have it up there. Uh, in the a video a couple times back, I hooked up the Panasonic uh, G7 and put it up there. And it just didn't seem like it was worth, you know, I... It just, this is so much easier, so much better. Now, um, at some point I may go back to playing with the Panasonic, you know, camera and put it in one of these positions or something. Um, what else did I want to tell you? I installed a 128 micro SD in here. I had a uh, 64 and I put it, you know, put it in. That makes me feel secure. And I, as I said, I bought a the rubberized for about eight dollars uh, case to put on here, and, and is on here now to protect it. Okay, I'm going to upload this now to YouTube, and I hope that the audio. I know the audio is going to be good with this microphone. It's a USB headset, and I know the audio should be okay, but. Uh, I hope it's in sync. It's really aggravating the uh, last few videos that I made where the, you know, I'm showing something and then it's, I'm talking about something else or whatever. So I think this will be okay. I thank you very much for watching.